being guilty or not being guilty guilty thoughts guilty feelings versus self accountability um i remember growing up like in our household a lot of the stuff that we go through that we deal with uh, in my household at least we grew up blaming my dad for it i do not understand or know that feeling of why we would do such a thing as a kid why would we carry ourselves that way it was just like you know what i'm saying so it's just like dang but fast forward here we are now like sometimes when me and my father hold conversations it's like I can, like, it's certain ways, like, you know uh, how you're trying to do better or you're trying to do a certain thing and you might do an action or something and somebody gets upset or you might have thought they got upset, so you'd be like, yo. And it's like, I kind of get that sometimes when me and my dad be talking, but it's like, here I am as a grown man now and a lot of things that I'm trying to do or trying to control, it's like, It's like I'm going down the same path as my dad somewhat. But it's like, dang, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like different emotions and feelings. But now, growing up, it was the guilty feeling of everything. I'm blaming everything else for why stuff was happening. But the more and more I learn to become like aware of everything I'm looking at or paying attention to or being more aware of your surroundings and everything, it's like, I done changed now. It's like, I'm very self accountable about a lot of stuff. I shot a video like right before this saying how sometimes you got to see it from other people's point of view, soften up, have a hard feel and stuff like that. Sometimes you get through that little feeling of like, I'm pretty sure everybody else has had this feeling like when you hurt, when you were struggling, when you was down or the way you took a loss, it hurt you and you felt like nobody else was feeling that same hurt. And sometimes like this is just, this is just my theory. Sometimes people mask their stuff up the same way you mask yours up. And now y'all both putting on characters or costumes, knowing that's not really what it is, knowing that's not really how neither one of y'all feel. But it's like, when I was trying to be a certain way, this is how everybody... So it's like this, this you know, this, it's like this back and forth on both sides, just trying to figure out like, which way do I go? How do I do it? How I say it? So you really just war and back and forth, back and forth. This is why you got to find a level of fast and prayer, meditation, things like that to keep your, I feel like it's just to keep this right here in the middle as much as possible. Like, I don't know what that is, but you know, they got the different sides or the different levels of your body and uh, acidic levels and everything. When you eat more junk and whatever, you start leaning more towards that. When you fast, pray, eat a lot of fruit. Man, honestly, I'm talking to y'all in a space or a position right now where I haven't been doing what I'm supposed to do. I have not been doing what I'm supposed to do as far as how I go about my day. Now, if you're going to incorporate, if you're going to add other people into your everyday, at least figure out how to incorporate them. They can't, like, take your time up. They can't take or stop everything that you're doing. You just, you know, I don't know, you got to figure it out. I feel like I kind of fumbled this topic a little bit. Hmm. Self accountability. First one to be guilty. There was a side of me just, you know, 
and a lot of times you can point the finger about all the stuff that other people did to you what about the stuff you didn't do um And that's the thing about wins and losses, guilty versus self-accountability. Them same situations you won in before, you might lose in tomorrow or today. And the same situation you lost in before, you might win now. But you have to go to both sides to understand. Yo, I lost over here, but now I know how to win now. I won over there and I took a loss. Now I know how to get back up and keep going. You have to lose in different ways, if that makes sense. You have to lose in different ways. And I honestly believe, like, when you start losing and winning in different circumstances and situations in your life, you begin to learn and understand life. You sit there and, like, you kind of evaluate what happened. Oh. Now you know how to take the jump um, a few steps further. Now there are different like thoughts, you know, emotions that might go through your head or my head about a lot of stuff. That's the hard part, having the control of emotions every day. I keep yourself on that straight and narrow. And sometimes it get hard. <laughs>